Now, fertilization is actually a type of sexual reproduction in which gametes are produced and united to form a, a, a zygote. Gametes are produced. And I've told you what these gametes are. We said they are called sex cells. So the union of these sex cells, to, in, uh, the union of these sex cells to produce actually a zygote is what we call fertilization. But I want to stretch this a little bit. Now, please take note: each of the sex cells, uh, for each of the sex cells, like the male sex cell, which is the spermatozoa, and the female sex cell, which is the egg cell. Each of these sex cells possess what we call the nucleus. The nucleus. And the nucleus possess what we call chromosomes. In fact, reproduction is interrelated with genetics. Okay? Because the formation of new offspring has to do with, or it also involves the transfer of traits from parents to their offsprings. Now, what is really important during fertilization as a type of sexual reproduction is not just the union of these sex cells, but the union of the nucleus in each of these sex cells. In fact, fertilization can be said to have occurred in a living organism, mostly mammals. Fertilization can be said to occur in a mammal when the male the nucleus of the male sex cell fuses with that of the female sex cell. That is when fertilization is actually said to have what occurred. Without the, the union of these um, nuclei, there is no formation of what a zygote. There is no formation of a zygote. Now also note that fertilization is carried out by higher plants and higher animals. You see fertilization also in um, um, lower plants like the invertebrates, which we'll be looking at much more later in other um, um, classes or lessons we're going to have. We're going to see how um, invertebrates, some invertebrates, undergo sexual reproduction by fertilization. Now, another type of sexual reproduction is what we call conjugation. Conjugation. It is the second type of sexual reproduction. Now, it is a type of sexual reproduction in which nuclear materials is passed from one cell to another. Nuclear materials is passed from one cell to another. There are several types of organisms that undergo conjugation. We're going to